That was the most brutal 20 minutes of my life. I'm sweating buckets. Sweat is literally dripping down my body right now. This will happen, right? I haven't vlogged in two days, by the way. I've missed you so much, and I'm sorry. I, the day we left Spain, I got so sick, and I've been so sick for the past few days. You can probably hear my voice. And I was dreading this flight back to LA because I was like, I don't want to go on a flight while being sick. The last two days, I've been dying and crying and just from freezing to sweating, freezing to sweating. I'm just... I got to the airport. There's like a two-hour line. Bless everyone that let me cut in front of them. I... I was running to my flight, like this, be real, I was power walking, I was power walking to my flight, probably look gross right now, I'm sorry, and then they're like doing last call and I'm like sweating and I have a fever and I'm like, God, please, God, please, my hair starts unraveling, I'm carrying my camera, I'm just like, I just, I'm in so much pain, just boogers in my nose, also, I'm so sorry to the one person that stopped me, a fan, and I was like, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm running late for my flight, I apologize, I have such a bad fever right now, I'm in the washroom of the airplane, because I wanted to tell you, but we made it, we're on our way back to LA. I refuse to be sick. I've been sick for two days. I'm behind on so much work. Today I'm flying back to LA. I have Ask Super One Live, the last one in the lily pad, and then I have the Moana premiere. So you already know it doesn't matter how sick I am. Nothing is gonna stop me from supporting DJ. So for this next four hours, I'm, you know, have a choice, Lily? Stop being sick, stop being sick. This is, that's it, it's done. I'm sweating so much. Oh, it's okay. I've done worse things on a fever. You do fan fest India here, remember that? <sighs> okay. Dripping, dripping. Go back into civilization. Here we go. No one's sick. I'm not sick. Are you definitely not? I'm not sick. Definitely back in LA because it's so hot. Also, I'm so I saw Matt. He was on my plane. The number of times that I'm on a plane with someone, I don't even realize until we're at the baggage claim. Um, but I was so like awkward because I'm like I'm so sick and I can't hear myself. So if I'm screaming, I'm sorry. If I'm screaming right now, I'm sorry. I might be whispering. I don't really know. But I'm so stubborn. I saw my bag coming and I'm like I know my bag is so heavy, but I don't want to ask anyone for help. So I lifted it and my hand got stuck between the bag and the conveyor belt. I don't know if you can see, but this is what stubbornness looks like. My skin is basically off. It's, it's okay because it's gonna be a good day. I'm sweating, fever, 27 degrees, it's all good. <sighs> Ask me how I'm doing Ask Superwoman Live in 30 minutes because I can't hear anything. I literally can't hear a single thing that is happening right now. We gonna see. All right, Humble is here to direct me. Look, Humble, you're back in the vlogs. Oh, you guys miss Humble? I forgot. You haven't seen him in so long. Hey. I talked to him like on the reg, so for me, it's just like, oh, it's Humble. Exactly. <laughs> but I realized, anyways, he's here to tell me if I'm screaming or whispering during my live stream. My ears aren't working today. My ears aren't absolutely, this is probably the worst. Fun fact, when you're sick and go on a plane, did you know your ears actually plug really, really bad? Mm. Because your sinus is already at F, so like, I can't hear anything that's happening right now. But we're gonna make it happen. What an emotional Ash Superman Live. It's still happening. Look, this is all of you. This is all of you here right now. All of you. Humble's here. We're going through the memories of the lily pad. I still can't hear anything, but it's okay because it's so worth it. We're going through so many beautiful moments and it's making me emotional. But it's been a really good time and it's about to end. And look, that's all of you. Look at you, you little baby. Look who's here. Hey, Looking hi. all pretty. Bringing me gifts. Also, I didn't realize, but my hand is actually really swollen. So I guess that injury was not minor at all. And now I'm basically... Look, look at me, look at me. I basically have a paw. Look at my hand, look what happened. Oh my gosh, I know. you beating somebody up? Yeah, that's what happened, still. <laughs> it's beginning, the army is here to get me ready and make me look, we're gonna go for a fun look with sneakers and a suit that has bulls on it. I'm gonna explain why it has bulls on it momentarily, but no one's sick, that's the most important part. No one is sick. All right, this is the vibes. I don't remember if I told you this, but the reason I'm wearing this specific uh, suit and kicks yeah. and everything is because it has bulls on it and Dwayne's main tattoo is of a bull. So I've been saving this outfit for when I would see Dwayne again. And here we go, the vibes, you know? Let me show you the full ting and ting. It's light, you know, just a little, so fresh, so clean, clean. My nose is running so much, I can't deal. And also I lost my license. These are things that are happening right now. So we are stuck in a ginormous amount of traffic right now and so extremely late. And I have such bad anxiety right now and I'm trying to figure out why and these are the reasons I have so far is, I'm, I shouldn't. I'm going to an event with Dwayne. Like, I should be over the moon. I am over the moon. Don't get me wrong. What's a different and, type of anxiety? Well, exactly. Same. I think that's probably... <laughs> attitude. One is I'm sick. Two is... I mean, I'm not sick. Two is I have to come home and make a video still. Three is I have an audition tomorrow morning. That's causing an immense amount of anxiety because I haven't done one in so long. Um, 
and I'm just trying to focus on my 12 collabs and every time I have time to focus on them something gets added to my schedule and it's causing me anxiety um, what else do I have anxiety about there's something else my hand really effing hurts yeah. that is also causing me anxiety and when the manicurist was massaging oh, they're not, they're not it they're not allowing me going just, oh, just let him know we're part of the event yeah just tell them we're part of the event hey bro whoop, whoop. and then because of the main things, the little things get out of Yes, yes. You think they'll make us, they'll let us have Yeah, yes, they'll let us. Let's just say we have your red carpet guests. It's okay. Just let them know, just let them know, just let them know. Say we have a red carpet guests. <laughs> That movie was so damn good, and I'm not even saying that. I know you're thinking, oh my god, Lily's just obsessed with Dwayne, and so she's biased, but hear it from someone unbiased. I used to hate on Disney movies all the time, <laughs> then inside really? out. I always, I have written, like, I've actually written, like, really? I, didn't, I did not movies. know that. I did not know that. Um, but then Inside Out came, and that changed me, and mm. I actually wrote an apology to Disney because of that. These guys did it again. They stepped it up, they showed a nice, powerful, young girl who's a hero, who's determined, who gets knocked down and gets back up multiple times. And is of time. color. Is of color. Yes, yes, it was a beautiful culture they displayed and I feel like, I don't know much about that culture, but I feel Polynesian like- Polynesian culture. Yeah, yeah Poly yes. but I feel like they depicted it. I know Dwayne wouldn't be part of something if they didn't depict it as is. So it was really, really good. It was funny. Like I laughed out loud several times. Yes. And it was really freaking good. Really? I encourage and you all to see it. the other thing that caught me off guard is you got The Rock singing and rapping. That's right. Rapping. That's my boo. That's my wow. boy. That's my boy. Also, uh, I saw when we took some cute pictures of the mannequin challenge. I'm gonna post it as well. He's so sweet. I told him, look, I don't know why I had like some. I still have major anxiety. I don't know what it is. I think it's a combination of. No, I have like real anxiety. Like no, I have no, no, real no. anxiety. And it's not about seeing Dwayne. I was talking. I think it's the audition. I think I'm not feeling well. And what I was explaining to Humble is that when you go to carpets, like there's so much happening. And so like because I'm sick. And I also took medicine and didn't eat that much. Like I'm already not feeling 100. Then to go onto a carpet with like, Lily, Lily, they're screaming and there's, there's so many there's people. There's the exact opposite of fun. <laughs> there's the exact. Well, that's not true. Of fun. I have a little fun, but they're the well, all. What, what, what part's fun? I'm not gonna say that. They're the exact opposite of calm. Okay. Like it's okay. not calm. Like there's just so many people, so much going on. So I was already feeling a little bit anxious, and I was just like, <gasps> so like I was a little bit out of it, and then I was talking to Dwayne, and then after I was stressing for the whole movie, being like, did I say something wrong to Dwayne? Did I not act nice? Did I, I do this every single time, every single time with him or Selena. If I talk to them for the next five hours, for the next like week, I'll be like, adorable did I? Mad. Say something okay, wrong. <laughs> let's pretend you. Let's pretend you're Dwayne, and okay. let's pretend I'm Lily. So you guys remember, like in the movie, the whole <gasps> and the kiss in the head, and she's excited. This is the, this is how Lily is now around Dwayne. Now, not Why? the first okay. time, but now. Go. Hello, Dwayne. That's not what I do. First of all, we hug and kiss. You're Shut like, up. You. That's not what happens. Hello, hello, but you know what is? I act calm around him because, okay, admittedly, like Mad I don't. Professional, I don't. Professional it's not professional. I'm just calm around him. I'm like, hey, babe, what's up? How are you? I'll do that to him. I won't be like, I don't want to freak out every but time. But I mean, it can be a little bit like, hey, how are you well, doing? Well, I mean, I told him I stalk him. That element of me is still yeah, there. Yeah, that was, that was He's good. like, I'm like, yeah, I know you had a long day. How do you know? I'm like, because I stalk you. That's exactly how I said it, too. So that was a little bit. Okay. But I always, like, I just, I don't want to be, because especially in those environments, like, Everyone is in his face. I don't want to add no, to that. No, it's very, you know? and, and I, I think he's used to you now. It's very casual. Yes, That's what it's I very realized. casual. It's but very but casual. But hey, I, what's up? What's I am still on? feeling very anxious. I don't know why. Now I'm thinking that maybe it's because I haven't eaten and I took medicine and my insides are just like. <gasps> that, that can't be. Really yeah, so they're trying to maybe think. I still have to make a video as well. So there's a lot of things going on. But the movie was damn good. Dwayne did so well in it. Friggin' amazing. You need to see when it comes out, Moana. Six stars. Six. When does it come Only out? allowed five? No, I think it's November 23rd, I'm pretty sure. But yeah! So I have no idea where my license is, which annoys me and I'm irritated at myself because remember when I lost my wristlet and then Humble found it in the thing and I was like, oh, I'm gonna take so much care. I don't, my individual license card is missing, which is strange because it should be in my wristlet, but it's not. So now I'm thinking, did I leave it in a pocket? But that doesn't make any sense because I never just individually take my license. It would be my license and my credit card, but I have my credit card. So now I don't know. Also, why do I have so much anxiety? I've just come to terms with, we'll talk about this later on the toilet, but I just need to be okay with my emotions. Sometimes we just feel these on, feel things on certain days. I think I just felt annoyed because I was like, I'm at the premiere, Dwayne's here, everything is great. And I felt so happy, but I think I'm just like, 
I have anxiety and I don't know why. I don't know why, like I felt like I was gonna have a legit panic attack walking on, I have no idea why and I can't get in tune with my emotions. Hello Pink Bra, how are you? License, are you here? Mm. We're gonna be more positive right now, but it's okay if we're not because you should be in tune with your emotions however they are. I'm gonna make a video. I might as well, my makeup's done. Um, and then we're gonna go from there. You know what I love about my stylist? Is she continuously puts me in outfits that don't require a bra, and so I never wear a bra. I just wear nipple covers, and it's great. Um, I know I keep going on about this feeling I'm having, but I don't know what to do about it. Uh, I literally can't focus on anything else. I have such bad anxiety. If I have the feeling of like, you know that feeling you have when you think something bad's gonna happen? That's what I have, but it's so intense. And like, I can't like, get rid of it, so. <laughs> yo, 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 I wanted to be sleeping by midnight, but now it's 1.16 a.m. I recorded the video, I'm editing right now. I think it's a video really, really, really like. It's not the skit I wrote a couple days ago because I was too sick to record it in the last two days, but um, it's called Four Reasons My Viewers Are The Best. So it's about you. Uh, and it's a fun video and I made it and I hope you enjoy it. And I can't wait to go to sleep because admittedly, uh, I'm so jittery still. <laughs> but we're gonna edit, finish editing. Fight through it, power through it, you can do it. Huh. All right, so the video is out. The time is two. 18, which is not that bad, but I still have to wash my face because there's a lot of makeup on my face. Um, and I have to go over my sides for my audition tomorrow. It can't be that I'm just nervous about my audition. I've done many auditions, sure, it's been a while since I've done one, but I don't think, I think I'm actually experiencing anxiety and I don't know why. And I feel for everyone that experiences anxiety regularly because it is a real thing. And I haven't even like eaten. This is how I know something's wrong. When we're in the theater, the popcorn was free. I ate almost none of it. It was on my lap and I was like, even just now I like made myself some dinner and and my maid I mean like warmed up some food and I barely ate it. I don't know what's wrong with me, but I'm gonna stop complaining about it and stop talking about it and wash my face and go to sleep and hopefully I wake up tomorrow with a renewed sense of purpose and less anxiety. Um Let's go do that. I'm actually just decided to end the vlog right now so that I can kind of meditate and be by myself and stuff. Um, this was a weird vlog. I'm sorry. I felt like I talked about the same thing. First, I was sick in the morning and I was sweating in a hot mess. And then I had anxiety for the rest of the day. And it, that's stupid because I went to an amazing event, saw an amazing movie with one of my favorite people on the planet who I'm lucky enough to call my friend and I have so much to be grateful for and I feel ungrateful <laughs> feeling anything except for pure bliss because of that. But uh, I, I don't know, something's wrong and I don't know what it is. And it's, that's weird because usually I can like talk myself, talk to myself and figure it out, but uh, it's okay. I'm not able to today and it might just genuinely be like, I don't know, some today, chemical imbalance in me that's not allowing it to happen. Um, but tomorrow's a new day and it's fine. And I'm going to wake up, I have an audition, then I have a meeting, then I have another meeting, and then I'm going to Bridget's concert, which is very exciting, so that's gonna happen. Um, but for now, I'm gonna go untie the knots in my stomach and the jitters in me and go to sleep. Thank you so much for joining me on today. I hope you had a lovely day. And I apologize again if any part of this vlog was super repetitive and you're like, yo, shut the F up, we get it, you have anxiety. But I don't know, I have anxiety. Uh, 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 uh. It's like a feeling I'm not extreme. The closest thing I can relate to this is like when I was like depressed, which I, I don't feel, but I feel some similar something. I'm hoping it's just a combination of the meds I took with like, the energy drink I drank, and it's like a bad combo or something. But if you like it, subscribe. If you like it, subscribe. I love you so much. If you like it, subscribe. Yeah. We on a boat. We on a boat. I am on a boat, and I am swimming with Nemo Dam. And me said, big fat fish falling from the sky. And I can't. Is that the words? Something to deny? Something, something. Oh my god, you guys are fighting in the back of my vlog, please. Note to self, add nice music in the background.